Hello, my lovely Virgo. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Virgo, today we'll do your daily read for the 21st and the 22nd of November. As you know, this daily might resonate with you, might not. Take it accordingly and leave what is not yours. But let's see here, loves, what we got for you for this daily. What the Spirit want to share with you. What's the energy behind you for the lovely Virgo? Virgos. Oof, we have Ten of Swords. My end a relationship with the water sign, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. It's kind of you do love somebody so much, but he's so much hurt in here. I don't feel you you want this hurt anymore. But let's see here the what this is about. Nine of Wands, Seven of Swords. Oof, I don't feel you even trust anything what is love about here. Yeah. Two of Wands, Four of Swords. The other person just just want to be by themselves. Let's see. Four of Wands. Seven of Pentacles. Death. For sure you are ending a relationship with the water sign. And it's kind of... You wait for what the next move is. Also you are waiting for a better future. I don't feel you, you Virgo, trust this person who you've been with. I feel here we've been a decision made in the past. They might tell you I want to be by myself and things and that, but I feel here they, they could end to, to betray you or cheat on you or just being sneaky around. Although it's kind of they they use your your good soul because I feel here you still love this person. I don't feel you are with this person anymore because we have death here too, ten of swords here and king of cups. Definitely you do love this person. For some of you you are basically moving on, ending a relationship with the water sign here. We have Scorpio, we, th we have Cancer. Also, I don't feel you, Virgo, are, are looking for love. Most likely, I feel here you, you are very much disappointing yourself. Like, you could be a long term with this person. A long, 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 like years, you put a lot of work in, in this. And you still have strong feelings for this person. For, for many of you Virgos it's just like. The love is very hard. Because every person comes in my life. Try to use me. Or they are not trustful. Or I don't trust. They are trust issues here. And I feel here. Something it is over here. For some of you, yes, you're waiting for to make a move here. My my look towards love. I feel here if you hold if you hold on on this person, the universe is telling you it is the time to move forward. Sag energy here. Although you don't want to move. Four of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles. You don't want it. It's kind of universe is pushing you forward. Go Virgo, go, go. Because where you're going is new love. They are new opportunities. But I don't feel it is somebody here might offer you this Ace of Cups. I don't feel you're looking towards it because you are moving away from this Ace of Cups. I don't feel here. 
might be somebody else offering you love and you don't really want to look at it yeah it's kind of you don't trust in love you you feel like unfulfilled not only in love it's like you feel like if love is not here nothing works but at the same time you waiting for for something it's kind of I'm waiting for something like a light into your life let's see here what you are waiting for what the Virgos waiting for page of cups do you want for this person to apologize for some of you you might have kids with this person but I feel here you're waiting for an apology you wait for this person to explain themselves or you you wait for this person it's kind of I I don't trust them whatever they've done but I still want them in my life there is real resistance temperance sad energy the universe is telling you you need to heal you've been through a lot lately Virgo sad energy we have twice for some of you, you might deal with a water sign or a Sagittarius here or I, I see very strongly Scorpio but I feel here this person wants to be single and heal and is required for you to to be patient also to have to have that healing also take your time death energy devil you end up to leave a karmic situation here Capricorn energy but I feel here something toxic you didn't want to end was for sure here need it's like needed to end even you you refuse to end even you didn't want it because I feel here you holding back so much which the universe kicked your ass go forward sorry my expression Virgos and I feel here eventually you you walking you walking it's kind of slowly but surely was in this situation could be four five or seven years seven it's a divine number as you know loves but I feel here there was too much hurt too much trouble take time and heal here loves for some of you you might feel like I need to stay this this is my life this is my fate and love is not toxic love is kind Virgos take time and heal I feel here could be a spouse of yours a husband somebody very controlling somebody very on the top of everything seven of swords knight of swords was a lot of like temper yelling somebody could be like this is not my fault it's just your fault a lot of blames somebody could bring the past back chariot cancer energy for sure here I feel here you Virgo you wanted to move forward but something holds you back as you see the Knight of Swords goes back, the Chariot go forward with a push and pull energy. Go back, go forward, go back, go forward. And that drain you, drain you emotionally, drain you, drain you basically from all the whole you. Could be a third party you not know about and now you do know. I feel here for many of you, you want new beginnings into your life. But Spirit says take time and heal. Also, I definitely see here there is something new here with this Ace of Cups. Let's see here. Who is this Ace of Cups? Why you don't want to look at it? 
why Virgo doesn't want to look to this Ace of Cups, this new beginning, this love new beginning. For many of you, you might lost a lot of money, a lot of finances, just being in this situation, this draining emotionally, draining financially. High Priestess, Pisces Energy. You know, it is somebody out there who love you or who will love you for who you are. Doesn't need to be a Piscean. But I feel here, it is somebody genuinely loves you. And you do know who is this person. But I don't feel you are interested. You might feel like this is not my person because you have so much to deal with what was in your past. Could be somebody you, you've done wrong to them or they've done wrong to you. It's just like I see a very much broken Virgo here. Somebody like, sorry guys if it's so negative reading. But it's just like there is a light there. You just need to look beyond. One more card. Sun. Yes, absolutely. And it is a tower moment here at the bottom. And loves, as I always tell you, there is something better, you know it. For some of you, you might not really focus on this offer. You might have a missed opportunity with somebody here. Pisces or Leo energy, fire sign, Leo, new beginning here. You know deep inside there is a new beginning. But you, it's kind of for some reason you cannot focus on this since you do not find your true you. Okay? Loves, as you know, not everything in this world is forever. And I always put this thing, we are like Legos, if you know what is a Lego. We need to dissemble sometimes some pieces to put them together again to be a more beautiful picture. And I will say here, you have the help from the universe to bring you to a better future. Look beyond what you have right now and see the light, what's coming towards you. Okay? So Virgos, I definitely see here there is good energy coming towards you. Just don't ignore it. Just do not ignore it. So loves, this is what I got for this daily. Keep your light up and the faith and love and light to all of you. Many blessings and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye for now.